Somebody get hurt. Brothers and sisters, we're uh, here right now at this time. Now we have mother and fathers, and these are the godparents, uh, uh, godparents, <clears throat> and we're going to uh, dedicate this young man uh, to the Lord. I want to say that children are a gift, an awesome gift from the Lord. And any gift that God gives us, uh, we need to be grateful for it. Be grateful for it. And this couple already know that uh, I know they're grateful because this is a miracle baby. If the devil had had his way, this baby wouldn't be here today. But because God is so good. Yes. Hallelujah. He he made a way. This baby was born two pounds? Two pounds. Oh, Premature. Premature. But look at him. <laughs> <laughs> look at him. Hallelujah. Deuteronomy uh, chapter 6 verses 4 through 9. It reads... Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord, and thou shalt love the Lord thy God with all thine heart, with all thine soul, and with all thy might. And these words which I command thee this day shall be in thine heart, in your heart, and you shall teach them diligently to your children. You shall talk of them when you sit down in your house and when you walk by the way and when you lie down and when you get up and you shall bind them uh, for a sign on thy hand write them on your hand and they shall be as frontless between your eye, eye, eyes in other words they'll be written on your eyelids even when you sleep and close your eyes you'll see the word of God and thou shalt write them on the post of thy house and on thy gates. In other words, the word is just to be uh, 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 infiltrate your whole being and your whole house and everything. You should have the word of God there. Your responsibility, um, first of all, you are 